Hey, what's up guys? Stefan here. Last week, we looked at comping, recording multiple takes and then choosing the best bits from each take to create the perfect take. If you're yet to see this, you can check it out here. Today, we're looking at cleaning up the vocal, cutting out the noise and breaths. Now, cutting out the breaths, this is more of a preference. I'd normally ask the vocalist beforehand, would you like me to keep the breaths in or take them out? A lot of rap songs where rappers have to take deep breaths, have their breaths taken out or turned down. It creates a cleaner sound. In the same light, a lot of vocalists have auto-tune or pitch correction on their voice too. Breaths can also get tuned in this process and believe me, it sounds awful. So it's real easy to do. Um, so I'm just going to show you real quick my process. I just grab the marquee tool, um, make sure it's selected up top, hold command and drag selecting from where the last phrase uh, tails off uh, to just before the breath begins in your, in your vocalist performance. And then you just click and this will cut your selection. Going. She's going. And I do this to the whole vocal. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna lie. It can take really long. Um, and there is a kind of quicker way, and I'll show you this um, afterwards, but I prefer this way and I'll tell you why um, when I do that. I then go back with the fade tool. So I switch up top so that when I hold command, it now um, becomes the fade tool as opposed to the marquee tool. I then fade out the end from where I've cut and fade in the beginnings of where I cut. So that fades in the breath. So what that does, it actually turns the breaths down. Um, it keeps them in there so you still get that natural sound and performance, but the breaths are not very prevalent as or as loud as they were before. Yeah, she had me on, she on, yeah. She had me on, she should have known there was something going. She should have known. Something going. She should have known there was something wrong. So I'll quickly show you the quick way of doing this. And that is to select the region you want to edit. Click functions and then scroll down to remove silence from audio region. So this will remove any parts of the region where the vocalist isn't actually rapping or singing. And you can adjust the sensitivity uh, by adjusting the threshold and the other parameters below. But with, with so many variants in a vocalist performance, parameter settings naturally will need to vary too. Um, having one setting for the whole region generally doesn't create a great result to be honest and that's why I don't use it and you can have a play about with it and just see I mean it's not a destructive process once you do it you can um, undo it and, and see um, what you prefer okay but that that is it um, after this we can actually begin the next stage which is automation to get a even level uh, an even level performance from the vocalist to catch that next week and for more videos like this hit that subscribe button if you enjoyed this video drop a comment in the comment section below and hit that like button I've been Stefan and as always happy beat making